Rocky Harris. I'm Rocky Harris. I'm Rocky Harris. And I'm here to give you the latest in entertainment news. You're a late night legend. Well, and, I no, I mean, you, you're a god. We have to just put yes, it out there. Yes, yes. <laughs> so what would you say has changed from late night since you've been on air? Well, see, I was lucky. I did, I did late night when Bush was dumb and Clinton was horny. And you know, it was a simpler time. In season one of Dear White People, you tackled a lot of controversial issues. Tell me some of the ones that you're gonna tackle in season two. Can you show me like a little glimpse of your scary face? Yes. Well, thank you so much, Grace. <laughs> <laughs> Who have been your Mrs. Which, your Mrs. Who, and your Mrs. What's It in your life, and why? Oh, oh my goodness, that's a tough question. I think you need to do all my red carpet interviews because you articulated that so well. Becky Harris from Black Hollywood Live and I'm on the set of The Real. So do you guys have like a turn up song in the morning to get ready? I listen to T Grizzly. Oh. So like that's that's my turn up. I don't song. have a turn up song. Uh no, I share a curtain with her. We have a <laughs> wall between us and it's a curtain actually. Okay, mm -hmm. what's my turn up song? The, for day one, you know what this one listened to two times in a row? <laughs> Uh-oh. What? Bodak Yellow. Oh! Wait, yes, what? She, I was no like, what would be a piece of advice that you just hand out to anyone, just a day by day advice to remember? Tell the truth. People don't tell the truth about who they are, what they want what they need, what they're up to, what they feel, what they see. Tell the truth and don't think that people have to agree with the truth as you know it in the moment. So I want to play a game with you. <gasps> okay. And I'm going to give you scenarios okay. and or captions, phrases, and you have to give me the best or most perfect hashtag to fit that scenario. Did you see how serious have I just ever, got? Is there ever a conflict of interest when it comes to you separating the two crafts when you're an actor and a director? And have you ever been on set and wanted to instruct someone else? Um, <clears throat> well, <laughs> I think, I think that, uh, just throw me right under the bus there. Well, the writers, she's brilliant. Okay, so now that you're here. I'm oh! No, now that you're here. You messed up. I, <laughs> no, I asked. I asked your character Emmett. I, I don't know if I'm digging too deep. Go in, go in. I'll dig. I'm ready for the deep. Is, is, is his name honoring Emmett Till? Wow. I'm speaking his name so that way it'll never be forgotten. He may have died, but he didn't die in vain. He was a sacrificial lamb so that we could be free. Yes. Let's hold him up and let's make sure, you know, his mother, his ancestors all know that he died for a reason. And he didn't have to die. And he was a little boy from Chicago. And, you know, his legacy lives on. Why do you on. think it's so important to have events like this that raise awareness for HIV AIDS? Ooh. You know what, like Tracy said before, knowing your status is very important. Yes. So each one, teach one, test one. How about yes. that? Oh, okay, that's the new slogan. Right here. Right, right. Boom. We go. seems to be an embarrassing and often awkward feeling us women get when we bring up our aunt flow. It's natural. And I'd like to empower you to think of it the same way that companies like Thinks and Fem do. They made it their mission to change exactly how the period is perceived. What's up? TV's Look, TV's new best friends. Come on, come yes. on. And I'm so happy to see you again. I'm happy to see you too killing the game. I mean, per usual. I mean, look at it. I, I'm killing it. What is this butterfly? What I mean, made you want? You know, he is fly. fly. Thank you. Okay. That is I mean, a better answer. And it's a new year. So your butterfly, you had your caterpillar. Had the caterpillar. Now we out here, we flying. This is everybody's butterfly year, okay? We're flying. You've been in your cocoon. <laughs> this is everybody's butterfly year. I'm speaking that into existence. There you go.